Good morning, everyone. Dave here. It is Wednesday, April the 13th, 2011. I hope everyone is enjoying this beautiful, wonderful day. Where I'm at, the sun is just shining. The birds are singing outside my window. I wish you could hear it. It's just, this is the day the Lord made. And our Lord is coming back. He's coming back soon. Let's rejoice and just be glad in this day. As promised, I want to share um, a reoccurring dream that I've had. The dream started um, going on a couple of years, two years back. Uh, the dream's unlike any normal dream that I usually have or you have, where, you know, there might be events, something that happened during the day or thoughts that we might have in our subconscious and we dream these dreams. A lot of times they don't make sense. Sometimes the dream, we're in one place in our dream and then all of a sudden we're uh, off. It doesn't make sense. We're doing something different. This dream is kind of like I'm sitting in a theater. Uh, I'm actually in the dream. I'm not in a theater, but it's like if I was sitting watching on a wide, wide screen in full Technicolor um, in, in 3D. It, it's just amazing. Okay, now the dream takes place, it starts out, I'm walking in this metropolitan city. Now, growing up in the, the metro Detroit area, suburbs of Detroit, I spent some time downtown. In a, if it wasn't downtown Detroit, nothing I was familiar with. Kind of the same buildings, um, but I was very unfamiliar where I was at. So I'm walking in this Metro, beautiful metropolitan city. The, tall, the skyscrapers were just beautiful. I mean, the sun was glistening in the dream. And you could see the sun reflecting off the, the steel of the skyscrapers. And as I'm walking, there's crowds of people walking. It's a busy, busy day. And uh, the ground, everything starts to shake. The buildings start to shake. The earth shakes. Um, the ground below my feet start to crack. And the, I can see the ground uh, opening up. It's an earthquake. So in my dream, I'm frantic. I'm running, trying to get away. I'm looking behind me in the build the glass in the buildings, the skyscrapers, the glass is just shattering out and falling to the ground. And the buildings are all of a sudden on fire. Again, this is like in 3D, it's in Technicolor. So I'm running and I want to get to my family. And I realize I'm not anywhere near my family. I'm not even in my own uh, state. I'm somewhere else. Now, this wasn't... Um, this wasn't a foreign country that I was in. It was the United States. Maybe I'm, I'm thinking somewhere in my dream that it took place in, in the South somewhere by the accent of the people as they're screaming and running. And uh, I'm frantic. I don't know uh, how to reach my, uh, my family. I'm so far away from home. And I look behind me and the, the buildings are ablaze. Everything's on fire. I notice in the sky there's a battle taking place. So we have fighter jets in the air as this terrible shaking of the earth is taking place and uh, they're chasing these objects they look like all i can say is you know i don't want to alter this dream because maybe i don't believe in ufos i'm not sure what i believe you know but there they were there were these objects and the battle was taking place in the sky and fire was raining down on the earth i'm talking uh this whole uh city was pretty much destroyed. I look behind me and the sky starts to turn black. It's like a thunderstorm was coming. I could hear not only now the ground shaking, I could hear the sky just rumbling. Then all of a sudden, um, like a giant scroll, the sky turned into a scroll and it started to roll back. And as the sky opened up and rolled back, there, I'm talking if, if this was, uh, there's no way, no one in the world no matter what part of the world you lived in, could not help but see this. There, in the sky, filling the entire, entire sky. It was the sky. It was, was our Lord. It was Jesus. He was dressed in white, and I remember some gold around his waist, and uh, I could hear the sound of trumpets. And I looked, and the one thing that I remember so clearly of, I looked at his legs. They, they were some kind of armor. It was like leather. Another band strapped around the calves of his legs, and I wake up. Again, this happened, uh, started about two years ago. Their little uh, event took place in my life, and I got really, really close to God. I, a very, uh, um, 
went to a Sunday service and uh, was totally engulfed in the Holy Spirit. And the dream started after that. Now, I want to say that after the beginning of the year, uh, 2011, I haven't had the dream. And I didn't have this dream every night. Um, the dream would come and, and, and you may not have it for a week, two weeks, then there it is again. But each time, the dream was never changed, was never altered in any way. It was always just like rewind, putting the rewind button on a, on, a, on a movie and watching it in full technicolor. Every aspect of the dream was the same. It was always the same. It never changed. So if you would, leave me a comment in the comment box or send me a message. But I'd like to know if uh, you've had any similar dreams or maybe you could uh, comment on what you think uh, the meaning of the dream was. Remember at the time, uh, you know, I don't watch a lot of television. And uh, back in my subconscious, there was no thought of earthquakes. Uh, I mean, today, no. If I had the dream today and I bring this out, of course. I mean, with the big Japan earthquake and... Uh, all that's happened since the beginning of the year. I mean, it's, I think it's on everybody's mind. We're probably all dreaming somehow about earthquakes, but you know, this has, this started two years ago, um, possibly two years ago. And as I said, I, since the beginning of the year, I haven't had the dream. So tell me what you think. What do you think um, is happening? And I want to thank all my new subscribers. I mean, it's I'm brand new here and uh, you know, Time is very, very short. We don't have a lot of time. It's time to find salvation. If you're not saved, it's time to become saved and to give yourself to uh, invite Jesus into your heart. Um, I want to thank everyone um, again. You know, keep your eye on the sky. That's all I'm going to say. I want to, a few things that are on my mind and I want to share them, but I'm going to wait till get a little few more subscribers, but you know, United States. It says in the Bible, uh, uh, great earthquakes. We've had one. Don't think they're over. They're not. Um, keep your eye on the southern states for now. And, um, you know, don't worry. Don't fret. Uh, rejoice. Rejoice in the second coming of Christ. God bless you all so much. Tell me what you think. Leave me a comment. Um, so subscribe to my videos. God bless you. Everyone have a wonderful, glorious day.